Hi guys, it's Nina from VR Focus. I'm joined by... Hi, I'm Joanne Dai. I am the co-founder of Astro Reality. So tell me a little bit about your projects. Uh, we kind of saw it last year. We played around with it. I really enjoyed it. Um, lots and lots of fun. What, what is it that you do? So initially we launched the Lunar, it's the moon model that's 3D printed and AR enabled moon model in the middle of 2017. And then um, in 2018 we launched the um, Earth model. We basically expanded our product SKUs to a lot of um, various models from the moon model to Earth and to solar system. It's called the solar system mini but also solar system ultimate. So we want to kind of expand our product skills and really make it you know uh, as a wide range for our consumer for our fans to um, enjoy we also have a, a bunch of notebooks all the products that we carry are all AR enabled so we really think that augmented reality gives an overlaid information and a very immersive user experience in a way so tell us about your new products that you're showcasing here at CES 2018 and why we should be excited about them. Yeah, definitely. Um, so in 2018, we launched the Earth model. So this Earth model, it's originally 3D printed. Um, but then we took this 3D printed seed model and, and cast and molded and hand paint every single one, just like the moon model uh, lunar. Then uh, we basically record the, the surface, the topography, and then have it all AR enabled. And in this augmented reality app, it's, it's really, um, it emphasizes not only geology, life, uh, meteorology, humanity, those type of, uh, all kind of categories uh, um, for our Earth, but also we emphasize a concept that Earth is changing. So you basically can drag the timeline and see how how um, situations were on Earth back in time. And you can really drag the timeline and see how it changes over time. Wow, that's amazing. So that's one of your new products. What other products do you so, have? So um, in 2019, what we are going to launch is um, Mars Pro. Um, I guess a lot of fans have already expected that we would launch Mars Pro uh, sooner or later. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a new product that we will launch it in the beginning of 2019. And I think it's fantastic because as, um, as everyone knows that Mars is a very hot topic and we are doing a, a lot of private agencies are doing a lot of um, you know, Mars exploration um, and also a lot of projects initiated by NASA. So we we, just, we really want to bridge science um, through augmented reality technology. It's really kind of um, embed some kind of missions or any researches or studies that kind of make Mars Pro AR enabled and make uh, our consumer and fans to learn more about Mars. With all of these planets, the Moon, Earth and Mars, do you think that it's being used in schools or it's also being used at universities to present and educate people about missions they potentially want to do? That's a great question. Um, we, we actually see Earth as a very, very good learning tool in classroom scenarios. Uh, so basically for, for students to be able to hands on and really feel this tactile and have this tactile experience and really break through the boundary of digital you know, um, information in devices, but also to be able to hands on physical objects. And those kind of learning experience is what we want to emphasize on Earth model. Um, so yeah, so Earth model, we are working with a lot of schools, um, not only in United States, but also uh, in Australia and a lot of the other countries in the world. Um, so many classrooms and schools are you know, using Earth as a teaching tool and a learning tool um, for students to basically uh, know the concept of Earth is changing. Okay, and we also have another product that you guys yeah. are doing as well. So, as I mentioned, uh, we kind of expanded our product skills. So, we uh, we are doing not only 3D printed models, not only 3D printed and hand painted models. Uh, we are doing AR enabled notebook. Um, but in the beginning of 2019, what we are going to launch is uh, this mug. Um, it's called Astro Reality Space Mug. It just looks like 
like a very regular and kind of ordinary mug, but actually it's a consumer level um, satellite, I would say, and it's called the Cygnus. Um, it's, it's just kind of like a spaceship Cygnus. Um, so basically what you can do is to use your phone, um, of course download our app and use our app to kind of point to this mug and then um, at the bottom of the mug you can see this little AR target kind of um, pattern and then basically use your app to point to that target then you will be able to see the surface of Earth. It's just like like a satellite image that you can see kind of um, it's just like the experience that you are flying over Earth um, we are using data from USGS so all these data and content are real data real content of course they are open source but we want to just really kind of embed it in our products and let our fans and consumers to experience so is it only going to be Earth or is it other uh, planets as well that might be coming out in the future? That's a great question. Um, so in, initially we wanted to do just the Earth. For Astro Reality Mug, uh, Space Mug, Cygnus is just a flying over Earth. So basically you can randomly seeing different parts of Earth as our um, Cygnus um, flying over the Earth. Um, but then in the future, I would say, we will come up a series of mug that is going to be flying over all kind of different planets. It will be very exciting and I'm looking forward to it. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much for your time. Where do we go and find these products? Yeah, definitely. Please um, go ahead to www.astroreality.com or you can just Google Astro Reality. It's A-S-T-R-O-R-E-A-L-I-T-Y. Uh, or you can go to App Store, just uh, type in Astro Reality. So uh, that's our brand, our name, and just Google it, you'll find us. And you'll be able to find the products on Amazon as well? Uh, yeah, definitely. Go to Amazon and <laughs> type in Astro Reality and you will find us. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Head over to VRFocus.com if you want to find out more about VR and AR. And I will see you in the next video.